Hey, good morning, good morning. Good to see you two cool cats. All right, speaking of cats, well, they're in the same, you know, a cat and a bird, same thing that go head to head. But this is a really cool place where if you were a cool wine cat, you could hang out. Um, I'm hanging out with Robin. Good morning, Robin. Good morning. Well, tell everybody where we are. We are at the Little Birdie Wine Nest in Parma. Bird, cat, bird, cat. Yeah. You that? <laughs> okay, so uh, well, tell us about your place. You really surprised me when I came in. How many? Bottles of wine? Over a thousand bottles of wine in this store. A thousand yes. bottles of wine. Yes. Sir. Restaurants only have like 500, yeah. 700. You guys have a thousand. How did all that start with you? Um, that started, I'm a certified sommelier, so I've been in the fine dining restaurant industry for a really long time, but I wanted to regain some sense of semblance with my family, not working so many late nights, and mm -hmm. get really creative and have it a creative outlet, which obviously this store is and for me. You, <laughs> it really is. When you say creative outlet, not only do you have a thousand bottles, what else do you guys do? This is crazy. We have coffee and bakery. We mm -hmm. have yoga and group fitness classes. We have a whole slew of different craft classes so you can sip and create all sorts of outdoor events, socially distanced events, basically everything under the sun. Oh, um, you're not kidding. <laughs> and that's what we're going to talk about this morning. Some of your classes are, your craft classes are really, really popular, aren't they? They are, yeah. They're a little tough for us to keep up with since we're so small, but mm -hmm. um, we're making everything from scratch and figuring out ways to do them in studio and at home. So it's painting. We're going to do some painting this morning? This morning we're going to do some painting, yes. And then you have this interesting way to adult trick-or-treat. Tell us about that. Yes. So this. Come on, you're uh, good. Oh, come on. She's through. going back to the yoga class. She's going okay. To fitness yeah. yeah. See, fitness class and wine. Go figure. Okay. <laughs> this weekend we're doing adult trick or treat um, at West Creek Reservation, kind of a couple blocks up the road. We're doing a whole bunch of different Halloween wines, and you trick or treat through the woods. There'll be live music and all sorts of fun stuff. Dude, that just sounds insane, right there. Yes. I think we. I think we just captured everybody with adult trick or treating through the woods with live music and wine. I think. Adults need a little bit of trick or treating <laughs> this year in 2020. Well, we'll explain that. That too so there's sure. a lot of things we're going to talk about it's very <laughs> very cool you you even god bless you have something that's browns related that we now oh, we might have love. to turn it into a christmas gift but we'll talk yeah, about that too yeah, or next week there's always next week <laughs> yeah, next year always <laughs> next year and next week okay the little birdie wine that's a very cool place right here in parma they're doing lots of great things we're actually going to paint and show you all kinds of cool stuff five state news at seven o'clock starts right now